The Selkie's Return, A Tale of the South Pacific by Ryan Baker. Years ago, a sailor had stumbled into our family's pawn shop, a small, cramped place in the South Pacific. He had a strange item to sell. A rug, but not just any rug. It was made of a shimmering, iridescent material that seemed to shift and change colors in the light. My grandfather, the shopkeeper, had been immediately intrigued and had bought it from the sailor for a fair price. As a poor teenager, I had always been fascinated by the rug, but I had never dared to touch it, let alone ask about it. It was as if it held a secret, a magic that only certain people could see. But one day, as I was rummaging through the shop storage room, I stumbled upon an old journal that had belonged to my grandfather. As I flipped through the pages, I found an entry that made my heart race. The sailor who had sold the rug to my grandfather had written about how it was not just a rug, but a selkie skin. A selkie, for those who don't know, is a mythical creature from the sea, said to have the ability to transform into a human. I couldn't believe it. The rug was a selkie skin, and I knew that I had to return it to its original owner. But how? I was just a poor teenager in the middle of the South Pacific, with no means of traveling to the sea. As I sat in the storage room, surrounded by the dusty artifacts of my family's pawn shop, I knew that I had to find a way. I had to return the selkie skin to its rightful owner, no matter the cost. And so, I began to dream of the adventure that lay ahead. The End